back to my channel. So today I'm going to be doing a Shein haul. Sheen, I know it's Sheen. I'll call it Shein because it just sounds better. So today I'm going to be doing a Sheen haul. Um, just a few items that I got from Sheen. Um, and the first items that, but before we get that far, I want you to go ahead and if you're not already subscribed, go ahead and subscribe to my channel. Um, go ahead and click the like button and also click the notification bell so you're notified anytime I upload a new video. Um, okay, so let's go ahead and get into the haul. So the first thing that we're going to go over is going to be these hats that I got. So the first hat is the minimalist fedora hat and it retails for $4.50. Um, so this is it. It got like a little black band with a little maroon little piece, feather piece on it. Now, I don't know how y'all wear it, but currently I have four bundles in the front of my head, so it's not going to just sit on the top of my head. So I'm gonna like try and like, you know, perch it how people be perching it in the back of the head. You know what I'm saying? So the next item that I have is the simple fedora hat. And that retails at three dollars. Like that's why I love Sheen Shein because like it's very reasonable and they sell like literally everything. And you can get everything at a, like a reasonably a really reasonable rate. So I'm kind of um, slurring my words. Thing. I be smoking weed. Yeah. All right. So this is the hat. And like I told y'all before, um, I have four bundles in the frontal, so it's probably not going to sit on my head, like, you know, up top. And I don't want to wear, like, any. Um, but it might not, like, I don't want to mess up my frontal. But, yeah, so. Um, just do it like that. So that's the second thing that I got from Sheetin. And, alright, so we're going to move on to the next thing. So the next thing I got is the red knit color block panel tooth dress. I got that in a large and it retails for $11. So it's like everything that I got from Sheen in a large. I probably could have got a medium because everything is so stretchy. Um, like I said, it's very stretchy. And you'll see it in the video. It's going to be either here or here. It's going to show me wearing it. Um, it's footage from my Instagram. And if you're not following me on Instagram, why not? Ahead. It's gonna be right here. Follow you, girl. So the next thing I got is the lace up side letter graphic body con dress. I got that in a large. Um, that retails for twenty one dollars. With this, like I've worn this before and washed it, and the color is still very vibrant. Um, it's like those throwback old school jersey dresses that we used to wear, like back in the day i'm not gonna tell y'all how old i am but back in the day if you remember a jersey dress then you you over 21 the next thing is the stand color graphic print crop sweatshirt and i got that in a large and it retails for 19 dollars now this isn't it's not really stretchy but I mean, it is, but not as much as everything else. And it says, time is money, because time is money, period. But yeah, um, this is it. It's cropped. Um, I love the pink. I love the quote. The shirt is just a vibe. Just, just go get the shirt, okay? Now, I'm going to go ahead and um, just do these pants. The high waist plaid skinny pants i got those in a 12 which is an extra large they retail at 12 dollars um this is them but yeah this is these are really stretchy i definitely could have got a medium in these and it's like the color would not fade so don't be afraid to size down with these um like some of the other stuff if you size down um if it's too if you stretch it too far the color won't be as vibrant but with these like the color will still be the same look how big this shit is it's wider than my body but i mean it looks good with it on you can see from the clip but yeah 
don't be afraid to size down in these. So the next item that we're going to talk about is this top that I have on. This is the mock neck pop art print shirt. Um, and that retails at $7. Um, so I got it in a extra large. Now it is very stretchy. Um, so you can kind of like, I could have got a medium because it's very, very stretchy and it's loose on me in this extra large. But if you like notice, like if you pull it, like if you get a smaller size and it stretches, the color isn't really the same. The color kind of like it's not as, the black isn't as black. Um, and then I also have on the Letter Graphic Puffer Vest Coat, which retails at $22. Um, I have it in a large. Um, it says Paris on the back in 89. Um, I mean, it will go across my whole chest if I wanted to, but. So the next thing I got is the Oliver Print Crisscross Cutout Tie Back Unitard Jumpsuit. And I got that in a large. It retails at $14. Now with this, this is kind of what I was trying to explain to you about as far as like getting your size. Because with this, it is very stretchy, but I wouldn't recommend sizing down because as you can see, like when you stretch it, like it is stretchy, it will fit you, but the colors won't be as vibrant. And so like you won't really see the print as well. So with this, I would recommend like getting, getting your normal size just so it doesn't stretch and mess up like the whole print, the color and everything that you're trying to do um, with the outfit. So next up, we've got the floral print lace up front ruffle trim ruched bodycon dress. Um, I got that in a large. It retails for $14. Um, this is it. It is very stretchy. I love the color. Um, same thing though. Like it'll kind of. The color kind of fade, like depending on how much it's stretched. So I would recommend getting your normal size in this, which my normal size is usually like large anywhere else. Um, I mean, I don't really have much to say about it. It's cute. I just paired it with a white blazer just for the try on. I don't think that I'm gonna wear them together. I might wear them together. I don't know. So the next thing is this neon lime one shoulder crop top. I got that in a large, it retails for $5. This thing, I mean, it looks okay on, but it's like just a rag. Like it's just like the thinnest material. It's just like a rag. This part, this string is too long and there's no way to adjust it. So if you look at the video, I don't know what type of video is gonna be on, but if you look at the video, like it's kind of like hangy and bunched up at the top for the stringy part, like, I don't know. I mean, it's cute, but just take that into consideration that this string is hangy and don't have high expectations because it's just like a thin rag. Like, it's just a thin piece of material. That's all I could describe it as. Um, but for $5, I mean, try this one like $3. All right, so the next two items um, are going to be the sexy type backless halter top and Oliver print pants. I got that in a large. Now, the top fit, but the bottoms would not zip up on my butt. Like my, you know, I, I got a little junk in my trunk. Oh my damn, she thick as fuck. So yeah, it wouldn't, <laughs> the bottoms wouldn't fit. I probably should've got a, a extra large. I don't know if I ordered a game, but, I mean, it's cute. I'll put the, you know, everything gonna be on the side anyway. Um, and then the other item that I got is the tie front crop tube top and stripe belted short set. Um, I got that in a size large. That retails for $10. And that didn't fit either. Same thing, the top fit, but the bottoms, because, you know, your girl is a little thick or whatever. <laughs> yeah, it didn't fit, so... Oh, and for the sexy tie backless halter top and all of her print pants, the retail price for that is um, $19. So. All right, y'all, so we finally made it to the end. So last but not least, I have the contrast panel zip up hoodie and sweatpants. I got it in a size large. It retails for $21. Now, 
as you can see in the video it looks very baggy it's very stretchy um it does kind of put you in the mind frame of like tommy hilfiger you know kind of it kind of gives you tommy hilfiger vibes um but yeah this jumpsuit is very very stretchy like very very stretchy like yeah it's a decent quality material i just would recommend definitely sizing down because I know I could have sized down to probably a medium, and it, it would have looked a whole lot better, at least to me anyway. You know, you do what's best for you or whatever. But anyways, we are done with the Shein haul, so if you have any comments or questions, go ahead and put that down below. Um, if you like these type of videos for me, go ahead and let me know down in the comments. That way I know to do more, you know, try on hauls like this. Um, if there are any other video requests that you guys have that you would like for me to do, go ahead and put that in the comment section as well. Um, but aside from that, thank you guys for watching my channel and I'll see y'all later.